Volume 3 Toy Bijan Ichiban Matoy and Sake Appetizer Simikawa Sake Brewery Company, Ltd. I'm tired today as well. Let's drink today as well. It SPREADS to the internal organs. It invades internal organs. It invades internal organs. This man, the president of Nishi no Miyabi Tokiwa, in Yuda Onsen, Yamaguchi Prefecture, has acquired numerous sake qualifications. Sake and side dish pairing channel. This is Kazuya Miyakawa. There are many alcoholic beverages that are positioned in Kuenshu. As Kuenshu representing Yamaguchi Prefecture, I would like to mention Dasa, which I introduced last time, or this toy Bijin Ichiban Matoi. Kuenshu is a fragrant sake. Toy Bijin is an oriental beauty. Toy Bijin Ichiban Matoi is known as a sake that Russian President Vladimir Putin visited Japan on December 15, 2016 and visited Otani Santo in Nagato City, Yamaguchi Prefecture, and had a drink with former Prime Minister Abe. This sake is made by Sumikawa Sake Brewery in Heiji City. Junmai Daijinjo Sake made by polishing Yamada Nishiki, the raw material for sake, to 40%. An elegant sake that perfectly harmonizes the umami of rice with the transparent acidity. A picture of no mask is reflected in the center of the 720 milliliters bottle. I feel that this no and kaijin aspect is a symbol of Japanese beauty. This naming gives an image of a mellow and elegant taste. Even if you have never drank sake, zero to one cup, even beginners will surely be familiar with it. The gorgeous and fruity flavor is impressive. Speaking of sweet and spicy, I think it's a little sweet. The alcohol content is 16%, and the rice milling is 40%. We cut 60% of the raw material brown rice and make sake with the rest 40%. Junmai Daijinjo is made only with rice, malted rice and water without adding alcohol for brewing. Moreover, polished rice is a high quality sake made by shaving to 50% or less. Developed by SSIFBO, which I have acquired a liquor qualification, I will introduce the classification by flavor characteristics in a diagram divided into four types. The horizontal axis is strong right side, light left side, strong or light. The vertical axis has a high scent and a low scent. Kuenshi Soshu Jukushu Jinshu Let's try the positioning of Toy Bijin Ichiban Matoi corresponds to Kunsiyo on the upper left. It has a very high scent, so I think it will be in Kuenshu. I will give a supplementary explanation about Kuenshu. Kuenshu is a sake with a gorgeous and fruity aroma. This scent is called Jinjo Ko, a scent produced by yeast and juko. The temperature range provided is rather narrow, and around 15 degrees is recommended. Or, I think that the serving temperature of about 10 to 15 degrees is good. If you lower the temperature further, it will be difficult to feel jinjioko. On the contrary, if the temperature is raised, the light refreshing feeling will be impaired. Kunshu is a sake that I would like to recommend to young people. Although it is sake, it has a flower-like scent and a fruit-like scent. In particular, this Toyo Bijin Ichiban Matoi has a tremendous fruity scent. Today's sake set. For Kunshu, I think a glass like a wine glass with curved lines is good. This is because the fruity jinjioka scent is trapped in a rounded glass. Alternatively, we recommend a glass that is not very wide and is close to a trumpet type. I'm going to drink this today, but I highly recommend it. This side dish, 
The dish I propose this time is sea bream carpaccio basil sauce, white fish and herb flavored salad. Kunsi goes well with dishes that have the aroma of herbs and citrus fruit. Basil is on the sea bream. The scent of basil matches perfectly with jinjioka from Toy Bijin Ichiban the Toy. I will taste it for a moment. Jinjo incense, basil flavor, and herb flavor match very well. Basil sauce is in the supermarket. I would like you to procure it with sashimi and make it at home. If you experience the Toyo Bijin Ichiban Matoi introduced this time, you will know the wonderfulness of sake. This scent is Jinji Oko. I think you can enjoy the experience of matching with basil. Everyone, thank you for subscribing to the channel. I will do my best next time, so please look forward to it.